So over here you can see that I'm inside a new Fresco document. And now let's see the interfaces that we have as options to work around with Fresco. So over here on the top left, there's the home icon. So if I were to click on it, it saves the document and goes up to home. So you can see that this is my document right here. So let me just get back in. On the left side, there are all the tools that I can use. So the default one right here, as you can see, is the pixel brush. And by clicking on, clicking and holding on these, what happens is that the options actually come up. And all of these options, what, what I can simply do is click and drag it out and they come out as these little boxes, what, what I, which I can use to customize. So I can go over here just like this and I can see that it just changes out just like that. I can keep this anywhere I want just like that and then go around and then uh, just keep it around on the side or so forth if I want to. So go over here and that's how it actually works like. So you can see that I can work around with different shapes right over here as well and work around with them. There's the move tool and everything else on the left side. Over here is the color picker right here. So what you can do is you can pick up the color you want right over here. So uh, the basic workflow is quite simple. So you can just pick out the color, choose the type of the brush you want. Let's say, for example, you want something like a watercolor, choose the type of the brush and then just go around. And you can see that there is a simulation of the uh, watercolor. So you can go around, select another color, for example, and then just uh, brush around and it mixes out as if you're using a real watercolor. And that is the cool part about Fresco. You see, you can choose the brush and work around just like with a watercolor and the color mixes out to give that watercolor look. So these are all of the options right here. So on the top, you can see this is the percentage right here. So you can actually pinch out. If you're using tablet, you can pinch out to zoom in or zoom out as well. Or you can use the scroll mouse button to zoom in and zoom out of the uh, window right over here, just like that. So you can go around and zoom in and zoom out just like that. All right. So what else you can do is on the right hand side, there's the layer option right here and there is the layer properties. You can choose blending mode and opacity from right over here, which are going to discuss in further lessons. There's also other option right over here. Just like, let's say, for example, you got like adding layer options right here and you can control the layers right here. The layer visibility is here and you can see that there's more option to control right over here. So besides that, you have the undo button right here on the top and you got the redo button. You got the question mark and the sharing option right here. And you can access out every settings from right over here. The, the settings on the artboard rotation and everything, the size, everything is here. So if you just want to view the document and start working on with the uh, project, you can press this button right here and what that does is brings everything in full screen mode. So you just see the brush that you're using so you can go around and choose the brush and that's it. That's the only one that appears and you can start drawing right here and start working out with the project. So how cool is that? You want to get back the tools, you simply click over here and you get back the tools over here just like that. So that is how you can actually work around with this. You can use the move tool, move this around over here as you can see and press done right here. So on the left side, there's the move tool as you can see right here. This is the move tool, click here and then you can move around the artboard according to what you want. You can zoom it in, go around and everything else is here. So we're going to take a look at all of these settings in further fresco lessons. So hope you guys enjoyed uh, learning as always and as always please like comment share and subscribe